Well, I always had a philosophy when I first started um, coming into the professional game coaching. My philosophy was always the same. I looked at, I always think you have to look at the players and the level to under, you have an, I think you have an overall overarching philosophy of how you want to play. Um, you know, I quite like quick transition football. You know, you look at the likes of Dortmund, Atletico Madrid, teams like that who have really quick, explosive football. Um, I've always enjoyed watching that. So from an authentic point of view, they're the type of teams that I want to I want to put out there, um, but with lots of quality as well. Um, but I think I think in, in terms of some of those aspects, I think you have to be. Um, you have to be authentic and true to yourself. When I first started, I had a philosophy for League Two. I had a philosophy if I was to get to League One, one for the Championship, one for the Premier League. It's not vastly different, but I think you just have to adjust slightly as you go up the level. So I think this, you know, a lot of League Two, when I first went into Birmingham, you couldn't ask some of the players to do the same things that I did when I went in at Derby because still have the same characteristics and principles. So, so I think you have to be flexible and adjust, adjust your philosophy as you go. But I think you have to keep the main framework of, of what you do. Um, but you learn all the time. You know, I've changed so many things along the way. But, you, but you're never too far away from of what you want. Again, authenticity for me is key. If you don't, if you try to be someone that you're not, players will see through it instantly and it'll be very difficult for you to be successful.